So the devs for Rack and Slay just came out with a new update where they introduced Endless Mode. Now I figured the best challenge to ever try Endless Mode on would be Explosives Expert. The premise is simple, same as any normal run, except enemies die every time they're hit by an explosion. So it should be pretty good, pretty interesting late game, I think, and we will find that out shortly. You can basically go as long as you want. We're trying to limit test a little bit here, see just how far we can make it. So it should be a good time. As the title says, we got a pretty insane run for you today. Hope you enjoy. Let's jump right in. Anything that gets hit by a bomb instantly dies. Okay. So that means <laughs> this thing I just got, the wild bomb, at the end of every shot, I just throw out this insanely powerful bomb that nukes enemies. So... You know, assuming we can make good use of that, we should be able to get a lot of freebies. A lot of cheap shots here and there, like that. And we can also break these, um, these obstacles with explosions and, you know, all that good stuff. And let's go here. Cool. Take two damage, not too bad. Um, I don't like any of these too much. We're looking for a lot of bomb synergy, naturally. Surrounded by coins. Richie. I mean, I think we'll just go for the guaranteed two per turn. Seems to be a little bit more consistent, perhaps. Five. Did you just see that? We just got five kills in a turn. That's beautiful. Then we'll just take you out. The nice part here is you start out immune to explosions, which is just fantastic. If you didn't, we would be in a lot of trouble. But since you do, um, that'll make our lives a lot easier. So if we want to blow up a bomb, we can just run right into it without worrying about getting, <laughs> you know, any sort of prankage as we're getting obliterated and just tossed around like a rag doll. This should work out a lot better. I had a feeling I was going to hit that spike. But I did it anyways. Yeah, we're just going to keep doing this. Keep getting these freebies from the wild bomb. Might as well grab a... Ooh, hello. Get a little uh, power. little shot power upgrade. Not bad. And then... So we have some extra shots. If we kill this guy right now... We'll have two extra shots to give us two gold. Or we can grab this gem, get five gold, and an extra health, and then we knock this bomb. Just a little bit of min-maxing, if you will. Get some extra health, always a good sign. So there's a few different types of upgrades that I think would really make this build shine. I th I'm hoping we get a few of them here. Because that would just make it all that much more fun. But we'll see. We'll see how lucky we can get here. Beautiful. Clunk you up a little bit. <laughs> nice snipe. I love it. Let's try to snipe this corner. I'm really bad at getting corner pockets. I'm like... You know, like, you're really close to this guy, but then you also have to hit it really far, precisely. Granted, yes, it's not that precise, but <laughs> I'm still not good at it. <laughs> Look at that snipe, though. That wild bomb was on a mission. Now this, okay, this volatile exodus, exactly what we're going for. <clears throat> so now enemies will kind of chain explosions across each other and just nuke everything. So this is perfect. Um, anything else that we want? Not really. When you co consume a collectible, you gain a gold. It's fine. It's not the most exciting thing ever, but maybe it doesn't have to be. So we go here. <laughs> Everybody just explodes. It's a beautiful sight. Um, let's go... Let's try to kind of like bonk you into you and then hit the spike. Or whatever that was. I'm not actually sure how he died, <laughs> but he did. So we'll take it. Um, so these guys are going to be a little tricky. They're like in this corner with no danger around them. 
Except for me, of course. I am the danger. I am the one who knocks. Okay, we're just gonna have to do it the old-fashioned way, I guess. I don't have any bombs to work with. Since this boss seems to be allergic to hitting any of the enemies. There, and then let's try to do another little bounce. Try to get a couple health ups. And then the last shot we'll use just to bonk him into a spike. Love to see it. Now what do we want here? We can get free rerolls whenever we get consumables. That actually sounds pretty solid. Okay, so let's go... Mm, how do we want to do this? There's no immediate, like, this is a really good shot. I think we can knock you into here. Kind of chain you two together. Maybe monk you into... Ooh, that chain... <laughs> I did not foresee everything chaining there. I love it. Sometimes it's a little deceptive how these chains are going to go. And then, yeah, if they end in a portal, they die. Love to see it. Try to get some more bomb synergies. 20% chance that when you take your shot, you throw a bomb in the opposite direction. Don't mind if I do. That sounds fantastic. So in that case, we could blow up this guy. So we go through this bomb, blows up you. This bomb blows up you too. I think this one also explodes. Okay, it did not. It was just out of range. But we can at least do... Trying to not to go in this portal here. Okay, that's fine. I keep forgetting that the, the keys go away. Or the, the obstacles go away. When they get hit by explosions. Keeps throwing me off. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, baby. We are so on. Alright, let's try to greed some more. Get some items, get some money. You know how it is. Dude, if we keep this up... Endless mode is going to be insane. I'm just telling you, this is going to be crazy. Let's see what we can get here. Chain, I don't think we really care about because everything's just exploding. Wild bomb, sure. Thank you. Um, Let's just roll. Duplicator is always appreciated. The chance to get just more additional items. How do you say no? Now this looks like the sweet spot if I ever seen one. <laughs> Hold on. What is that gonna be? Six guys from just these bombs? Wait, why didn't these explode? These didn't explode, but ones that I thought would and did. I'm a little confused. That's fine. This bonky real nice here. And see it's taking us like no shots whatsoever. Um, we could run this again to get an increased explosion radius. I'd say I think I might. I'm just picturing if you get explosion radius big enough, you just hit one bomb and everything explodes. <laughs> that would be kind of nice. See, look at this. Everything's just dying immediately. Alright, go here. Just get a little bonk. And again, I'm not really too worried about getting, getting hit by anything like losing health isn't a huge concern trinity okay see we're already on the boss here but we're definitely gonna go endless so we'll grab trinity um how do we want to any good easy hits here kind of i'm thinking if we hit the edge of this bomb we might be able to reach berserky we did huge <laughs> Look at that. That was huge. And now if I hit this in, does it hit foggy? No, not quite. We're not that lucky. Come on. Beautiful. And now we're just down to the boss. Let's get a little shot speed up. Get the diamond. We did take a hit there. That's unfortunate. We'll take some health ups here. And then, can I just like nudge you in real nice? Maybe get the diamond on the way? Beautiful. Beautiful. Love to see it. Now we'll go endless. Um, what do we got here? Balance diet obviously is going to be really good. 
When aren't we defeating multiple enemies out in one turn? So we can just get some extra max health. Why not? Um, well this actually kind of sucks. Hold on. We can try to knock you in, get some explosion chaining here maybe? Dude, he knocked us out. Okay, we're good. Explosion radius is insane already. This is wild. <laughs> Absolutely wild. I right, just bonk you in. Might have to do this the old-fashioned way. I don't really want to hit you in here because you're just gonna spawn somebody else. You gotta like hit him in a in a bomb. All right, now we can take you out. Beautiful. We're at 66 gold. Not bad. Get an extra shot. Why not? Um, one obstacle you touch is destroyed in an explosion. I like explosions. I like the sound of that. So now in endless mode, it's going to be a boss battle every time. And you have to beat every enemy in the boss battle. So a slight little change of events as to the previous ones. Um, so we don't have any of those like intermediate things anymore. Well, that's fantastic. Uh, I think we explode you and try to bonk you into a spike. Oh, okay, so you do bounce back off the obstacle when it explodes. That's good to know. Huge, and then, yeah, we just got the boss left. Maybe, okay, so we have 11 shots. Maybe we should take this time to recoup some of our lost health. And now we can just toss you. Oh, no, now we can toss you. <laughs> That's more like it. Alright, um, I don't like any of these too much. Let's roll. This seems great. Every explosion you get two gold, don't mind if I do. Gold issues are a thing of the past now. And let's go... Let's bonk you real quick. Yeah, <laughs> just explode everybody real quick. Let's just take out the entire enemy force in one shot. Seems okay. And we'll go bonk here, and then just sauce you. That's when it gets a little funky, is when you hit the bomb and then it like, it kills him before you have a chance to bounce into it. Okay. We already have fuel to the fire, however, it does give us an extra 10% explosion radius. Maybe we do that, and honestly, I mean, we'll take some extra, just some random bomb, I, some random items, hopefully bombs, we'll see. <laughs> what the heck was that? Everybody just died immediately. <laughs> Holy, all right. Now we're talking, okay. Was that like an ex like an extra special bomb level or something? How did everybody just get nuked? Holy moly. All right, yeah, this one isn't quite as insane. <laughs> Though still insane, to be fair. Try to get you out of this corner, maybe? That's good enough. That'll do just fine. And then we'll throw you in. I'd rather not take a hit here if I could avoid it. Come on, hit him. You know you want to. Just hit that guy. <laughs> Alright, whatever. <laughs> That's fine. 134 gold is insane. I mean, this here is basically free 10 gold every round. We'll see why we don't take that. Alright, what are we looking at? This looks like it's gonna chain everywhere, so let's just let's bonk you guys out real quick. <laughs> it chain it did. Oh wild. Alright, let's get you in. There we go. I don't know if there is any way for us to lose at this point. I think we need to use some of our free rerolls actually. Because we have the reroll synergy item, the rainbow die. We might as well. Get shot power whenever you defeat a non-normie. That actually sounds fantastic. 
considering how many non-normie enemies there are. And then yeah, also for the rerolls, um, not for the rerolls, for the endless mode, you take increased damage per enemy left over. Not that it matters in this <laughs> particular instance, but that's how they make it more difficult. So, you know. Do with that as you will, I suppose. So on any level that isn't this, you know, it's it's actually really good. Like a really good way to scale up difficulty. I don't think there's any way to scale up difficulty when you're talking this kind of build. You know, like, you're kinda... <laughs> if you defeat everything in one shot, you know, how do you... You Maybe they need to make some enemies that are immune to explosions, you know? Maybe that would be the way to do it. Because as of now, <laughs> this is a little insane. If I do say so myself. Okay, we'll go here, grab the stop. Well, I was gonna grab that other gem, but okay. Frenzy's great. Again, killing multiple enemies. Always preferred. And we'll grab a random item. Let's bonk you into you. Everybody's dead? Question mark. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's just... Oh, Trinity's perfect. We could absolutely break the game right here if we get the right Trinity item. I say as the game is thoroughly broken already. Without a doubt. 500 gold, what the hell? Alright, we gotta look for the perfect item. Tr Frenzy's great. That's not the perfect one. Increased explosion radius? I'm down. I'm down to try it. <laughs> oh no, no. And we can get rusher, so we get more gold and shot power when we one shot a level. This is turning into an absolute madness. Oh, we actually- oh, we did kill them all. No, we didn't! This guy survived. Look at the explosion radius, by the way. Let me just take a second and appreciate that. Okay, so I mean, at this point, all we're really looking for is some way to heal, I think. Wild Bomb's fine, but not exciting. Coins explode, sure. <laughs> As if we need more ways to explode. Duplicator I will always take. I think Duplicator is the best item in the game. Maybe trumped a little bit by Trinity, perhaps. Though the jury's out on that one. Yeah, a little bit of a an epilepsy warning, I think, on this one. This is getting kind of insane. Just huge bright flash and everyone's gone. Ooh, Materialist could be good here. We can heal up a little bit. What else have we got? Something good? Um, I think we have enough explosion radius here. What else have we got? Trinity? Sure. I will always take it. Everyone's dead. Perfect. <laughs> and then one little bomb just shoots out, just for fun. As if it was ever going to be needed. Could just get a bunch more gold. I think we got that one covered, though. 20 gold per turn. Still pretty good, but again, I think we're alright. Golden bandage, hold on. <clears throat> if we don't heal, two gold for every missing point of health now. That's a lot of gold. And you get three of them from Trinity. Hey, don't mind if I do. How much gold is it? So we're at 52. 310. That's actually not that exciting. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be better. Alright, whatever. Everyone's gone. I wish I could just go around and collect all these little coins sitting around. Okay, what's going on with our power? We just saw uh, it costs a, a little under a thousand gold to level it up. That's interesting. Magic fork is huge. We just get more free items at the end of the round. Don't mind if I do. Come on, something good. Something fantastic, please. Something just absolutely game-breakingly good. Hmm. Hmm. 
Rag is not bad. Just gives us more gold. Loot box is also tempting. You get 50 gold on the spot. I'm looking for something like really insane though. You know, something just... <laughs> well, this is 50 gold on the spot as well. Yeah, that's the other thing. They changed it, so those items are capped now, <laughs> unfortunately. We get another magic fork. Actually, for every 8 gold you spend in a level, you gain shot power. <laughs> As every shot costs 360. Hold on, how much shot power are we getting? 1518 goes to 1743. Alright, this is insane. This is going to the heckin' moon right here. I think it might already be. <laughs> Alright, so we aren't gonna get any of our, you know, losing health golden bandage anymore because we're healing now. I think that's okay. I don't think we're gonna need it. Duplicator again, don't mind if I do. What else have we got? Anything? We'll get rack. Get some more gold, why not? It literally doesn't matter where you point and click in battle anymore. Go lock and key. Hey, we get something. We got some loot boxes. Don't mind if I do. Roll. Use up all of our gold. Anything? Anything good? Something crazy? The 15% seems a little inconsequential now. Grab another magic fork. Or stun ball, maybe. Let's go stun ball. Let's get some more gold. Look at all these enemies. I don't even know how many enemies that is. 2,415 divided by 23. Anyone got some quick maths on them? We rolling? We rolling? Use up all of our stuff here. All of our moolah. Let's see if the chain does work. Extra bombs, why not? So, I guess it's gonna be hard to tell if the chain worked, because we get so much money just from explosions. I would assume it doesn't, but I don't really know how to verify. I don't think there is any way to verify. Okay. Maybe this is gonna be the test to see how quickly you can get, how quickly you can get a million shot power. That'd be a fun little challenge. Cause at this point we have to have some sort of end condition. Cause this obviously is not ending anytime soon. Maybe we can scale up quick enough to get a million. That would be kinda neat. Card balls, I guess. Uh -huh. We have to go a little quicker if we're gonna do this million shot power. We're at 10,000. <laughs> Not very close to a million yet. Money is power is gonna help though. The more of those we get, the better. So we're already at 12,000. Clumsy trade, sure. So we're looking for... What is that one called? I already forgot the name. There's so many items. We're looking for money as power, and we're looking for the fork. What is he? Magic fork, sorry. He's, he's magical. The more of those we get, the closer we're gonna be to our million shot power target. Beautiful. Uh, anything good? I don't know what happened to all our rerolls. Unless he got that reroll eating item. Gain one gold per free item reroll you have, and lose all your item rerolls. I don't know if that's a good thing or not for us. A big game hunter, lock and key. I say just grab like literally anything. <laughs> wild, absolutely wild. Drop in the bucket, but we'll grab a power cue. Rainbow die doesn't actually work anymore. Now that we are losing all of our rerolls. I wonder how many enemies we have to do have here. Gotta be at almost like a hundred at this point. 
right? Surely. Magic fork again, don't mind if I do. We're gonna get to a point where we just have too many items. Already taking much longer in battle than it is actually <laughs> getting all the items. Or, you know, doing the shop phase. Bounds diet, I guess. Anything good here? Anything good here? Money is power, that's what we're looking for. Money is power again. You just keep giving them to me, I'll take them. Golden armor, why not? Loot box, sure. Magic fork, yeah. Okay, so we're up to almost 50,000. 25 minutes into the game. Can we get to a million before 30 minutes? Probably not. <laughs> but I think we could get close. We're gonna have to move a little quicker, I think, if we're gonna make it happen. Banker, Rusher, Loot Box. I like Loot Box because it uses gold for us, so we don't have to. So many explosions. Oh, we got it. We finally got the item. I was worried about binary. And now we get, we get sauced a little bit. Only get to choose between two. <clears throat> I think we're just gonna like just start taking stuff, you know. Really, we're looking at just scaling up super fast. Get through all the levels. Get whatever items they give you. It doesn't really matter unless it's money is power. I don't think we care. I'm going to be looking here on the left side, see if we get anything I want, otherwise I'm spam cl clicking the right one. Everything's gone. <laughs> We're at 19,000 gold. Sorry, 20,000 gold, almost. Okay, Mimic. Take some money. Frenzy, sure. Helps a little bit. Um, let's use up some of our gold. So we're getting how much? 114. We're getting almost 2,000% shot power every time we get another shot. <laughs> That's pretty good. Frenzy. Is there any way to kill them before you even shoot? You know, can you just get like... <laughs> can you kill everything without shooting? That would be awesome. Alright, here, just keep taking items. I wish there was some way to like, s intentionally skip. Maybe if you connect like a... We have a controller. Can you speed up the, the item acquiring at all? I don't even know if this is set up for a controller. Not really, because it, it, as soon as you grab it and collect an item, it goes down. You have to like do this weird little, <laughs> which I guess is a little quicker, a little quicker than actually physically moving your mouse up and down. Um, I don't know how to play with the controller, <laughs> which I don't really need to now. All right, we're almost a fifth of the way there. We got a minute left before 30. Beautiful. Just see how quickly we can do this. Controller is a lot quicker than mouse when you're trying to speed through the the the, the shop. Alright. Grab a whole bunch of shots here. Grab some items. <laughs> I 
<laughs> that was gnarly, dude. Gnarly, dude. Love it. Look at all these spikes surrounding us, too. It's kind of neat. We're up almost two, three hundred thousand. So we're, we, we're probably going to be missing something um, in the shop, I'm sure. I think it really matters. <laughs> we're at level 51 out of 10. We've officially reached the ultra late game. Oh, we got another money is power, that's huge. Everyone's gone. So I'm curious, if you... Close our eyes while everything goes explody. Lights everywhere. If you... Can you just like get infinite items here? Oh. <laughs> it costs infinity gold. No. They were one step ahead of me. Oh, we got Trinity. Bonk. 380,000. We're almost there. We're getting close. Like a Bloom's Tower Defense kind of explosion vibe. That's what I'm getting. You can't hold down to buy either. You have to like spam it. items. <laughs> Late game is a scary place, I'll tell you that much. It's interesting, they, they cap the items, but they don't cap anything else per level. Like per shop. Surprised. Oh, we survived this time. What the heck? We actually didn't lose. We have reached halfway. I repeat, we have reached halfway. Grab as many items as it'll let us. Spend the rest of the gold on the shots. Because using it on this. Actually, I guess it's slightly better, because you also get the 5% power. <laughs> Ever so slightly better. Let's grab Trinity. Let's actually roll a little bit. See if we can get money as power. No, no, no. I really don't want Magic Fork. I already have to spend so much time spamming items. Trinity again. There it is. <laughs> Hold on, how many do we have right now? Money is power, we have... Where is it? Where is it? There's so many items. 21, now we have... 26, we got five. Nice. <laughs> Beautiful stuff. Bonk. 46 times enemy damage. We're stuffed so far in that corner, it's hilarious. Seven hundred thousand, we're getting close. We're getting so close, I can taste it. It. <laughs> it's gonna give me a headache. 311 shots left. What a thing. What a thing to say. You know, how how crazy is that? We're at 800,000. Come on. We're almost there. The torture is almost up. At this point, I don't, I don't want anything. I don't want any items. Please don't freeze before we get it. That'd be very sad. This is the only time I will ever go this far into endless mode. But I want to see that that million shot power. See what that does. What that does to a person. Hold on. We're going to get it this round. 
I think we are. Oh, hold on, hold on. Look, look, look. There it is. Almost exactly, too. <laughs> oh, baby. 1,093,000 shot power. How ridiculous is that? Which I don't, I don't think the, the little indicator in battle actually changes. Oh yeah, we actually did kill people already, but they don't explode it beforehand. It might. I mean, look how tiny the actual bar is. <laughs> There's probably a shot power level that exists where you would just straight up clip through the map and be gone. Like one frame you're here, the next frame you're gone. <laughs> <laughs> We're kind of close to it, actually. That that lagged out for a good little while. <clears throat> okay. Okay. I kind of want to push it. I kind of want to like actually break the game, you know? 1.1 million. Dude, it's coming. In. It's coming quick. Start grabbing some more shots as well. Because why not? Got another money is power in there. Okay. If I go straight down. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe there's a chance that would happen. I don't know. So we have a majillion explosions. And we get 14 times 2, 28 gold per explosion. One more try, see if this is enough to get out of the bounds. <laughs> I don't even know if that's a possibility. It feels like it's lagging longer and longer. <laughs> the more I'm, I'm like, the more shot power we're getting. Which just makes me want to break the game even more. Can we break it? Do you think that's like a thing? Do you think it's a possibility? Gotta go real quick. We're getting this thing on the lock out here. All right, let's try it again. That felt good. Oh, just kidding. That one's less insane. There may be some sort of fail save or something to make sure that doesn't happen. It's just a matter of how quickly you can click the, the one little button. triangulate the explosions and you're you're gonna find it all right two million is where I'm calling it if we don't have it by two million I think it's gonna have to be <laughs> we're gonna have to call it there all right send it through the through the roof to the moon let's see what happens Somehow we just stopped over here. Don't ask me how. Went into overdrive just thinking about it. <laughs> Alright, well I'm gonna call it there. I don't think there's any way to literally break the game, but figuratively speaking, the game has been broken. From like turn 5 <laughs> and we're on 65. 
<laughs> Hope you enjoy it. I thought this would be a fun one to do endless mode on because it's just so insane. Um, so hope you enjoy. Let me know if you want to see some more Rack and Slay. I didn't know if we were going to make another video on it, but I'm glad we're here. I'm glad they in incorporate endless mode, even if there's just trying it out on these absolute shenanigans of a of a build here. <laughs> hope you enjoy. I'll catch you on the next one. And as a fun little aside, this is how long it took me to actually break the game. <laughs> we're at 4 million percent shot power. It does eventually settle down, but then it just freezes. So it's permanently fast forwarding right now, and I waited for a good little bit to see if it would fix itself, but it didn't, so... <laughs> I don't know what caused it to break, but something is... Something's looping on the back end here, and I don't think it's gonna come out. So, you know, in case you were curious, <laughs> we're gonna stop at 4 million here. It doesn't look all that different. It's just a flash and a bunch of bombs and then you're done. <laughs>